Good morning from a new vlog here in America. It's our San Antonio day. Yeah, we're going to do a few different attractions today. We're actually in Max and Louis New York Diner first though. It's about 10 a.m. so we're having like a brunch before we head into San Antonio City. And yeah, we've got a few attractions lined up, including I think Tower of the Americas. Uh, we'll go to get some good observation footage. Yeah, yeah we're going to do the open top bus as well. See the Alamo. Kind of as well. There's loads to see and do. It's just nice to look around the city, yeah. isn't it, while we're here? So we'll We'll talk more in detail about that after we've ate here. But I just wanted to show you this at first. I'll spin you because it's quite hard to <laughs> vlog at that angle. Yeah, yeah we're in a, a nice little booth. Well, I think we're about 15 minutes outside of the city. And yeah, Max and Louis, this menu is massive. There's, so, There's too much choice. so much choice. You've got your breakfast, waffles. I really don't know what to have. Deli sandwiches. Oh my See, God. we had because we had a cracker barrel yesterday morning. You don't want a breakfast. So yeah, I don't want a breakfast. I might try a sandwich. Um, we even got spaghetti and meatballs, pizzas, <laughs> calzones, chicken, steak. Oh, meatball. Oh. Meatball parmesan. Oh, that just sounds, sounds nice. amazing, doesn't it? Yeah. I just like the style of it as well when you come into Burgers. a diner. Burger, fries, and shake. Just order it. What are you fancying? I don't know. I mean, honestly, there's too much choice. The Max and Louis. That's the thing. Sometimes Look at that. I hate it when it's a massive menu. Yeah. I just want it all, but we can't. Obviously, this is a New York inspired diner. I've never been to New York, but stay to you have, haven't you? Yeah. And the food's it. nice there. Amazing. Right, we're going to. Have a look at this menu then, get some drinks ordered first. I think I'm going to get a coffee and then, yeah, we'll show you what food with chores. Wow, <laughs> big enough for you. It's massive. I know, God's huge. Yes, I went for unlimited coffee refills and I did get the meatball and mozzarella sub. I think it's a little bit nicer looking than Subway's. Yeah, it's huge. <laughs> I didn't even know it came with fries. No. And then you've gone for the pastrami burger with bacon. Look at, Look the, at the lettuce. The burger. Oh my god. <laughs> how, how am I going to eat this? Look. <laughs> <laughs> it's huge. Is it as big as my head? This might do us all day. Yeah, we'll eat this now then, and then, yeah, see you at San Antonio. San Antonio, it's going to be another warm one today, I think. Yeah, it I'm is. I'm hoping it's not as bad because we are in and out of attractions. Yeah. And I've just seen the roof block ah, there. Looks so nice. It looks quite shaded. Yeah. All the trees. Looking forward to walking along there later on. Yeah, really nice meal, Max and Louise. Very yeah. full now. You get a lot done. The you? portion sizes are crazy. Yeah. yeah. She's like, do you want dessert? I was like, no. <laughs> no. Too much? Yeah, I give a solid. 8 out of 10 fries were a little lukewarm, but it was nice. Yeah, my burger was nice. Yeah, so uh, we've drove about 10 minutes or so from there. Just parked up, uh, bang in the centre, multi-storey car park. Really good price. Very reasonable, $10 for all day. Compared to when we went to San Francisco, for example, I think we paid $35. And that was the cheapest. Yeah. Some, some of them were like $70, weren't they? Yeah. $60. But there seems to be loads of parking around here all fairly cheap so yeah I'll just pay on the way out once we return to the car so the plan for today then we do have the go city san antonio pass actually used that yesterday at uh, fiesta texas really easy to use well. yeah you just scan it so if you want to see the city it's a good idea to get that because you get uh, loads of attractions at a discounted price and you can pick and choose which ones you want to do we 
could have done the zoo as well, but yeah. just too much, there's too much to do. So we've chose the five uh, option. So we used six flags yesterday, so we can do four things with that today. The plan is to do the open top bus, do a lapper there, and that's how you get to see most of the city. Yeah. Uh, we're also going to do Tower of the Americas, yeah, take view. you up. And I think there's a 4D theatre, I don't know, Within I don't know what it, it is. Yeah. There's a ride off. I think it's included. We'll obviously let you know later. Uh, what else are we doing? The big um, place. Yeah, well, when I booked this on the app, they were included. I think it's like uh, Ripley's Haunted Adventure attraction and Guinness Book of Records. But it's been taken off now. But I have emailed to ask, and they said this you can still use yeah. use it for that. So wait, wait, wait. 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 So we're going to go there as well, and if we can use it for them, we'll go in there too. Yeah. We're walking to the uh, the bus. We're going to go to the um, ticket office yeah. now. And get on um, the exchange tickets. Wait, wait. Yeah, get on the open top bus and do a lap. So we've scanned our Go City app and got our bus tickets, very straightforward, no issues at all. We've actually just gone and done Ripley's Haunted Adventure, a little walk through, a little scare attraction here. That's in a separate vlog because it's uh, quite a fairly long walk through, I think over 10 minutes. So that should be the next video on the channel. Uh, we're just waiting for this open top bus to come. I think it was an, about an hour, so it's nearly time now. So we've just done that. Stacey's just sat down in the shade. Ready to go and get this bus? Yeah. Yeah. I think the uh, pickup point is just down there. And it's right by the Alamo as well, which we will show later on. Yeah, maybe. We will uh, get on the bus. We need a drink of water. And uh, yeah, we'll do a, a lap of the city, just taking some awesome. of the views. <laughs> Pretty good view of the album from here. Here we go then. We're running here for an hour or so. Look, on top of the city of San Antonio, it's pretty good. Warm, isn't it? Putting any low hanging branches throughout the route. Yeah, Alamo. Even weather conditions and wind, it looks like it's going to hit you. It just fine, so please be careful and done. He just announced it's free entry as well, didn't yeah, he? Yeah, to go in. You don't need like a reservation. Yeah, so we're going. You must have needed to because of the water. Well, let's get going and get some nice footage of the city of San Antonio out on the open top bus. Yeah, masks are provided to lead to the left of the aisle in case you arrive at a location.
manage from the 30 minutes up there in that heat to have to come down and do it. It is far too hot, my place, so it's like I have been in a swimming pool. It's dripping. Yeah, I've got the lovely air con on the line. It's a great way to see a new city, the open air bus tour. Yeah, we, we, we've done some factory bus, if you can hear, there's a um, speaker on, and each stop the guy gives different facts about the places. It was interesting to learn as well that they can't build any uh, skyscrapers yeah. because of the Alamo, because they're not allowed any shadows yeah, on top of it. It's quite an open city. Yeah, they're going to be looked at that. You can see there's not many tall, tall airfields, is there? Not like New York or yeah. when you see like that. I think uh, there's 18 stops on this tour. I think we're on number 14 now, so let's wait until we get back to where we started. And then we're going to get a drink because we've run out of water. My water went warm yeah. within about two minutes. And then I think we might go do the sea lights because that's included in the house. Yeah, and well. it'll be nice and cool yeah. in there. Um, yeah, see some sharks. So I will uh, wait till we finish on here and get to the next attraction. Ah, that's better after a nice drink. A little tip for you if you're out in an American city, go somewhere like McDonald's and you get free refills. So, We've had about four, haven't we? Yeah, for $1.50. Ooh, nice and refreshing now. So we're actually going to do then the sea life, which I believe is relatively new here. Well, the reason we're doing it now is it's the hottest part of the day, yeah. so we need to be indoors. Yeah. It's 30, about 39 degrees. Hopefully there'll be some nice air con in here. So Sea Life San Antonio. Got the Legoland Discovery Centre. Yeah. It's quite a lot, isn't it? There's loads to do here, yeah. I mean, this is a San Antonio attractions vlog, but there's a lot more to see and do than what we're doing today. Oh, oh sorry. Oh, yeah. That's good. cool, isn't it? Awesome. Yeah. Got a little souvenir map. Yeah. Right, let's go and meet some fish then. We've obviously done a few sea lifes over the years. Here's a new one to add to the list. Go then, nice and easy. Just wait here. Hey, see you later. Time. Yeah, so as you can see, I think the tickets are about twenty-five dollars per adult, oh, obviously included. We're going to go City Pass. You asked, didn't you? It only opened three years ago. Yeah. Yeah. It certainly looks it. No. We always get asked, don't we? Yeah, I don't think it's going to be huge because it actually looks like it's in a shopping mall. We'll have a little look around for 20 minutes. Here. Yeah. Smells nice. Yeah, only well, well, fishy. She'll be taking photos. There she is. 
You like them? What? You like them? Lobster. Oh, lobster! I didn't even see them. No, I really like the tank. Yeah. But you can see around just like where you see a big ship, isn't it? Mm. And if you keep looking at the, um, the water, it makes them blue pictures. <laughs> we'll keep heading around then. I see we see some sharks and I think there's jellyfish as well. To go. Yeah, good seeing the sharks then, wasn't it's it? Really, it's really nice attraction. Yeah. Again, I just walked to the lady there and it's only been open a year. Mm. You can it's help very new. Clean and all the staff will look That was a nice little stop off at the Sea Life. Next up then we are going to the Alamo for a little while and then we're going to head to the Tower of the Americas. Uh, yeah. So Alamo, in a simple sentence Stacey, what's it all about? Well, it was the um, battle, so it was like the battle between Texas and Mexico lasted for around 13 days but it was mm. for independence so that Texas became in independent from Mexico. Yeah. <clears throat> um, and yeah, it's now present in the city of San Antonio. Cool, so yeah, it's a very important part of the history of San Antonio. We will go inside and I think it's free entry. It uh, is, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we'll take you in then. Yeah, so if you are coming to San Antonio to visit the Alamo, tickets are free. You just pick them up from the Alamo Welcome Centre. Just there. Yeah, really nice grounds. Oh, nice, and nice and shaded, yeah. Yeah, so you have to get the ticket for the Alamo Church itself. But I think you can just walk around here for free. Well, it's free anyway. Yeah, you know what I mean. You have to go... You don't need a ticket to walk through this bit. Some of the trees are beautiful, aren't they? Seen the palm trees. Lovely. It's a nice city, isn't it? It's very safe as it's well. It's very Being nice, loads yeah. Of police around. It's relatively yeah, quiet as well. I know it's only a weekday, but it's not New York, is it? Yeah, no, it's definitely not New York. I think it's the heat, isn't it? Yeah. Here we are in San 
inside then. Loads of facts and the history of the Alamo. I didn't expect it to be like a lot bigger. Yeah? <laughs> Very popular. It smells. Isn't it? Isn't it, it does, yeah. When you come out on these theme park trips, it's nice to see a bit of history, isn't it? We go outside of here then, and yeah, head to Tower of the Americas. Right, we made our way over to Tower of the Americas and it's actually been about an hour or so since we last filmed something. We went and got a nice frozen margarita. It was too much though. Uh, oh, Stacy doesn't feel very well, bless her. It's the heat. <laughs> it's hot, isn't it? Yeah. Got loads of water, so hopefully I feel better soon. I can't believe some of them though, like some of the Texans, they're like walking around with jeans on. Yeah, I don't know how they do it. Yeah, yeah it's stuff. crazy. It well, yeah. must be very, very hot. <laughs> yeah. Uh. yeah, there's an example, God. If you can see then, just through the trees, the tallest building in San Antonio, 360 degree observation deck. And I think there's a 4D uh, theatre ride included. Uh, I'll see what the name of it is. One second, it's on my the Go City app. Well. Yeah, oh, I, it's so quiet around here, isn't it? Once you get out of the main city. Pretty quiet anyway. Yeah. It is midweek. Yeah, skies over Texas. You got 4D theatre ride included. I don't know if I'll be able to film, but we can we can try. Right, see you when we get to the top then of Tower of the Americas. Right, after a little wait, we are at the top. 750 feet high. Get some yeah. Tells you here. Oh yeah, it tells you, there you go. Tells you the mission. I wonder if we can see Six Flags and SeaWorld. <laughs> we can go right down there as well. Yeah. We won't spend ages up here because the 4D theatre ride is on at 6 o'clock in about 25 minutes. Yeah, let's get a better view down here. Feeling any better? A little bit, it's just my throat. Yeah. <laughs> Seeing the pool there, the pool. Hmm. There's one there. Oh, imagine being in that pool. That's what I'm looking forward to getting. Yeah, when we get back to our hotel. It's nice views. Yeah. Do you prefer the um, Empire State Building <laughs> on top of the rock? Well, I think that's a bit taller. Yeah. <laughs> See the miles, right? Yeah. Yeah, as we mentioned, there's not a lot of tall buildings really. No. no. 
There's a lot of green as well. There is, yeah, look at all the greenery. Look at all the shade. <laughs> I always wonder where are all these cars going? Can't see any. Nice breeze. What's over this way? Is that a roller coaster right at the back? Or is that just wishful thinking? I don't know. <laughs> We've got a good look, I can't see SeaWorld or Fiesta, Texas, but they are around this area. You can all my voice. <laughs> well, I've Google mapped it and Six Flags is over in this direction. Somewhere over Maybe there. You might, if you can see there's a massive power station yeah. back to around this area and then SeaWorld's around 25 minutes in this direction. Yeah. You can't actually see it, but you know can't, make, can't make it out. Oh, yeah, and SeaWorld will be tomorrow as well as ZDTs. And then we leave we San Antonio. We get to um, film on the mark, yeah. so we'll be fun. Plenty of water rides. Yeah. Right, we'll head down then and get queue in for this yeah. 4D theatre ride. Go. Some folks believe that the skies over Texas are just about as close to heaven as you can get. Above the Lone Star State, the land and water spread out before you like the most beautiful welcome mat over to lead you just about anywhere, including a place where Texas and American heritage soars, where at any moment a cowboy might take off on a flight of his own. Texas, competition isn't just a game, it's a way of life. And nowhere does the competitive spirit burn brighter than beneath the luminescent lights of high school football on a Friday night from the sky. While other places require an entirely different mode of transport. For all of the water in Texas, there's only one natural lake in the state, Caddo Lake. And when you enter the swamplands of Texas, you're entering a timeless world of mystery and wonder. A world where the banks are lined with cypress trees, thick with Spanish oh, moss, and the murky waters are overflowing with big adventure. over Texas, the more you come to appreciate the beauty, grandeur, and scope of the Lone Star State. Texas really is different from any other place. Today, Texas is a world capital of innovation and opportunity. It's home to more than 20 million people. And it remains a towering example of success that should make every American proud. When you've been away from Texas for a while, you just can't wait to get back. So few places on earth offer such a bountiful tapestry of culture the walk, and right. tradition. Yeah.
just come out of skies over Texas. It was all right. <laughs> old technology. Very isn't old. It? Yeah. But it was included in the admission, so yeah, if you come and do the observation tower, may as well see that show. And I think there was Ice Age as well. And Wonder Woman. Yeah, yeah. so they've got three shows on every 20 minutes. We're heading now then to the last sort of attraction we're going to do in San Antonio, the River Walk Boat Tour. We've saved it for a little bit later just because of the heat. Yeah. Um, it's just a little bit cool. I think it's quite shaded as well because you go underneath all of yeah. the bridges. I think it's about a 30 minute boat tour and then once we've done that we'll head back to the car and end the vlog the way we started it <laughs> with food. I'm hoping that I'm going to be hungry. Yeah. It's right now. I'm, I'm not still, too hungry but. I'm still full from earlier. Yeah I think we will be by the time we get there. We're going to Smoke Shack get some proper beef brisket and it should be nice yeah and then we'll end the vlog but it's been a great chilled day today hasn't it you're feeling a little better now as well a little bit it's yeah. just my throat's a bit sore and i think i'm just thirsty yeah, yeah i just need a nice cold glass of water we'll find this some this way's the river walk let's yeah. get to the river walk then because we haven't really seen it much yeah. and it's obviously a highlight of san antonio it's yeah, just a some... shame we can't see it at night now i know because it's meant to be lovely it doesn't get dark, doesn't until, get dark till late. Half ten. Yeah. Never, Never mind. mind. Alright, we'll head over there then and get some footage of the river walk. Should be nice. there from the river walk oh, oh it was my favorite part i loved it very nice we've actually just come now to smoke shack yeah. for some beef brisket i'll show you the menu now you've got all of your side um one slider plus two sides kids meals all of the barbecue See, usually plates. i would have gone for a plate yeah. but i'm not starving after max no. and louise so we're going for the brisket grilled cheese. You do get one side with it, so I'm going to yeah. get mac and cheese. Yes. Yeah, and then you get your unlimited lemonade. By the way, this is a small lemonade. <laughs> Should have seen the large. It's anyway, so I don't know why you get the large. No. Because you can go and refill the small. Yeah, I'll show you the food once it comes out, but we we are hungry again, aren't we? A little. Mm, this looks nice, and it's just enough, isn't it? It's the smallest meal for us so far, but yeah. we didn't want a massive like platter of biscuit. Yeah. Because we are having an IHOP breakfast in the morning yeah. as well. Looking forward to that. But yeah, we're hungry, so eat this now. It's filled with beef brisket. This is what small trucks known for the brisket, so hopefully oh, it's the mac nice. And cheese is delicious. Good. Mm, nice. 
have this and yeah we'll head back to the car in the vlog oh that was delicious and just enough as well wasn't it the best beef brisket i've ever had Definitely. so tender tasty just juicy bit. 10 out of 10. I really enjoyed it yeah if you ever come to san antonio smoke shack, smoke shack. As we've said before, we've done a lot of research for food and so <laughs> far we've not had one bad yeah, meal. It's all been nice. Heading back to the car now then, just parked there. Yeah, we'll end the vlog here. It's been a great day exploring a brand new city. That's such really a fun nice, day, isn't it? Yeah. We've done loads. We've done the open top bus tour. We've seen the Alamo. We've been on the river. We've done the Tower of the Americas. Nice food. Yeah, and we Stop also... Yeah, we went in Sea Life and we did Ripley's Haunted Adventure, which is in a separate vlog to this one with a full walkthrough, yeah. so make sure you check that out. Yeah, tomorrow we've got a busy day again. SeaWorld, San Antonio and ZDTs to get from Switchback. It's going to be a great day. You probably look like sweaty messes again. They probably do, yeah. <laughs> We're actually going to go and jump in the pool now, back at our hotel, cool off. Yeah, we'll end it there then, so thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, of course, remember to leave a huge like and a comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And we will see you in the next vlog here from San Antonio.